The Presbyterian missionary work was started in Punjab in 1849 with a vision to transform lives through education and community development, enabling each person to achieve their full potential. Education is the only hope for Pakistan when nearly 25 million children are out of school. In 1972, the government of Pakistan nationalized the schools due to national reform. In 1998, the government denationalized the schools and seven out of 10 schools were returned to PEB in deplorable conditions. Currently, PEB has 24 schools with 19 new buildings. In 1998, the graduation rate was very low, but now over 95% of students graduate and many are enjoying successful careers as doctors, engineers, nurses and advocates. The number of PEB high achievers in the government examinations is increasing each year. In addition to their studies, students are encouraged to participate in co-curricular activities such as debates, sports, arts and singing. These activities are very important in developing interpersonal skills for their future. PEB places a high priority on teacher training. Each year, training programs are conducted by local and international trainers for improving teaching methodologies and experiences. The student population of PEB schools has grown from a few hundred students to nearly 6,000. From four PEB employees in 1998 to over 600 employees today. The Presbyterian Education Board schools are recognized for providing quality education. Mrs. Fira Shaheen Gill, the Executive Director of the Presbyterian Education Board Pakistan, here reflects on her motivation for joining PEB and the 20-year journey that followed. In the early 1900s, a young girl, Mohanda Bibi, was admitted in the boarding house in Sangla Hill on scholarship. Mohanda became a school teacher, got married, had two daughters, dear friends, the youngest, the brightest one is in front of you. I have the permission of my older one to say so. My mother, Mohanda Bibi, was my motivation to join PEB to educate the poorest of the poor. The last 20 years of denationalization has been a story of patience, persistence, perseverance and prayers. It is a story of God's grace and it is a story of miracles happening in Pakistan and it is a story of God's people joining hands, working together to bring a positive change in Pakistan. I am so grateful to friends of PEB and many friends around the world, those who have joined hands, they are God's hands on earth. Their guidance and support has been a source of strength for PEB. God has blessed PEB in so many ways. But thousands and thousands of children are still out of school in Pakistan. We envision providing education to as many children as means can allow us. Dear friends, please join hands in educating the children in Pakistan. We strongly believe education is the key to bring about positive change in Pakistan and around the world. May God bless you all. May God bless Pakistan. Pakistan, Zindabad.